I am no one, Gabrielle. I have no sparkles. Hi, guys. And we're going to have a little fun today. I feel like we're in for something really good. <laughs> she looks dangerous and fun. <laughs> right on. Hi, guys. This is Played Again. I'm Ginger. And I'm Mike. And I was feeling a little, I don't know, funky. Mm -hmm. For like two days, he said to me, who's that French girl that we did? And her video was super cute. I finally remembered. Yes. It was in Dila. And I feel bad because we wanted to get back to her shortly after doing her last. The song was so catchy and the video was so cool. It was wicked catchy. And neither one of us could remember her damn name. We had to start hunting through the playlist and figure out where we put it. So we did. And it was in Dila. So I found another song. Okay. Because you wanted to do her again. This yeah. one's a live performance called Run Run. All right. I'm so ready to run run. Maybe it's in English this time. Okay. Still going to be super cute. I just know it. <laughs> do it. Alors, euh, la dernière chanson que je vais vous interpréter s'appelle Run Run. Et cette chanson, elle, est, elle a été écrite de manière très décontractée, légère. Mais euh, ce sont surtout des, des mots justes et simples qui disent qu'on qu court très vite. Après, après certaines choses qui sont malheureusement futiles. Et c'est surtout une chanson qui rappelle que le bonheur, ce n'est pas quelque chose qu'on attend, ce n'est pas quelque chose qu'on oui, oui, qu essaye d'avoir. Le bonheur, c'est juste de comprendre qu'il qu faut accepter ce qu'on a déjà. Le bonheur, ça se trouve dans les choses simples. Et Run Run est là pour nous le dire. Alors, on est parti. Oh, she's so adorable. I love her accent. I feel like I'm in Paris already. It's amazing, right? Eastern feel to it a little.
<laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> that was another catchy one. I was going to say, she does catchy so super well so far. Two for two. Yeah, that was really catchy. It had a good, really kind of beat and momentum to it. I loved it. I love her voice. Yeah. Even though I don't understand like 90% of what the hell she's saying. I still love listening to her voice. It's beautiful. Oh, yeah. And that, that stuff on the high guitar string. Beauti yeah, beautiful. Yeah, fabulous, little, right? Like just the single tones and then the little melodies up there. Yeah. Oh, the whole thing is like right under my skin. <laughs> I wanted to play that thing that the dude was the playing with the little brushes. Thing, yeah. Whatever that was. I don't know what it's <laughs> called. It's like, this looks like somebody cobbled it together in the back room. It's like, oh, we got some uh, things laying around. <laughs> it sounded it, good though. The suitcase. <laughs> it was great. I'm glad you reminded me of her. I'm glad because I remembered. Because we, we both really did enjoy that last song. And this was another good one. So we're going to have to do more of her because I, so. I do love her. I really enjoy listening to French singers. Yeah. Right? Like we've done Milan, mm -hmm. Farmer, and there's Laura Fabian. Yeah. Right? Like uh, I love Hi this. guys, Paco Valou. See? So I, I love the sound of their voice and the accent's always really cool. So I'm a sucker. That's all it takes, guys. That's all it takes. <laughs> Anyway, hopefully you all enjoyed that too. I know you're going to want to say play it again because it's so catchy. How could you not? Does it get stuck in your... <laughs> Ginger's got the practical question. <laughs> I'll hold your upper part still while you shake, baby. Help you learn. <laughs> the coconut just fell right behind us. You good, bro. And we go... Doot.